Okay, this one's about electronic fan controls. Now I've shown you this thing. It was inside a Lennox from about 1992. Uh, but this was kind of an in-between thing. So they, uh, they were trying to uh, eliminate heat-operated fan switches. And uh, so they come up with these electronic uh, fan switches, which would delay the on time of the uh, fan motor. Uh, the burners would come on, there'd be a delay time, and then the fan would come on, and then the burners would go off, and there's another delay here. This is an on delay, this is an off delay, and this is adjustable. Uh, what they've done on newer ones is they just build it into the integrated furnace control and don't use these silly things. And they don't need them. Uh, these things are kind of dinosaurs, I guess. And let's kind of show what, what all the parts are in these things. Okay, so we'll go over this little thing and what all the terminals mean and so on. Okay, here we have 24 volt AC power. This is powered all the time. We got common and switched. Then we've got valve. What this is, this is an input from the gas valve. So when the gas valve comes on, it'll start the on delay. We've also, of course, when the gas valve shuts off, then it'll engage the off delay. However, if at any time during the cycle, the limit switch opens. That's going to leave the. That's going to bypass all these delays, and keep the fan on as long as the limit's open. So, uh, these are all low voltage. This is your high voltage here. You've got a common. You got a normally open and normally closed. Uh, generally, that's going to be set up so that. Uh, there's power or there's a circuit between the common and the normally open and the fan will be hooked onto this normally open so that when this timing completes it will energize the relay turn on the fan and then when the off delay uh, finishes this timing then this will go back to normally open and shut off the fan and that's about it for the uh, electronic fan control.